Hey everyone, this is Kinsei Reaction and welcome back to my live reaction on Pokemon Horizon and this will be episode 4. Yes, the fourth episode of Pokemon Horizon. Last week's episode was pretty great, pretty great, which is the Sprigatito Rescue mission that we have. Rico and also, yes, the Rising Ball Attackers are going to go look for the Explorers which is going to be Amityos and the others and yeah um, that was a very good episode I guess because, because I, I mean the story is kind of simple but you know if you think about it we're kind of getting uh, like a lot of stuff that are going like for example um, you know Freed and Amityo are kind of having like a rivalry that is the, the, that, that will be going and it, it's going to be continuing for the rest of the series I can guarantee it. And right now, you know, last episode, they, you know, the rising vault hackers, I think Freed and the others are clearly said that they were hired by Rico's mom to be her bodyguard this time. So I guess Rico's mom knows that someone is like, you know, aiming for Rico and that's the explorers. And they are asking the rising vault hacker to protect her, like, or like in the, in the canto. So yeah, it makes sense. And right now, I guess their purpose is that Rico has fun officially joining the team. I really like it. She is one of the like the rising vault hackers. And uh, right now, they're heading to Paldea, where uh, where we get to see Rico's house. And they, I, I guess they were ask, they're gonna go ask for money. <laughs> That's funny. That is really funny. And you know, at least they're heading to Paldea, which is definitely a great news because I don't want to see any more Kanto, Johto, Hoenn or other different region anymore. Please, let's go to Paldea. So really excited for that. But before that, we're going to go pick up Roy first. So this episode, we're going to see a lot of Roy and the interaction with Rico in this episode. So super excited. And without further ado, let's get started on our reaction. <coughs> All right. Before I get to my live action, I want to say I first enjoy all of my live reaction of videos. Please leave a like and also subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell for not missing my future live reaction. And also don't forget to share this video and content as well. Alright, let's get started. So Pokemon Horizon episode 4 will begin in 3, 2, 1, and let's go! <laughs> my adventure with Sprigatito has finally begun! Nice, nice, nice. <laughs> yes, you are on the airship. And I guess this is your room from now on. Okay. Let's go. I want to see some, uh, like, new stuff. I mean, right now, I have to say, you know, Rico Sprigatito has a lot of potential. That Leaf Edge is like a level of Leaf Storm. So that could be like, a, you know, you know, a really good potential. Maybe, you know, like Rico just not just maxed out his Sprigatito at the beginning. So <laughs> I just want to point that out. And I just that, that Sprigatito definitely hyper trained like some of the stats, right? <laughs> uh, <laughs> that's going to be really funny. And... Yeah, you know, it says that yeah, she will like attend an you know, online class, so she's not gonna go back to school like like for the for a very long time, for a very long time. So she's gonna have online classes, which I'm curious for that as well. And right now, yeah, I'm just very curious that how are they gonna interact with Roy? Roy did down the flag for the Rising Vault Hackers last episode, so you know he's gonna get the flag back. So I wonder how are they going to end up to his island. Really excited, really excited. <laughs> well, I just really looking forward for the further adventure for this whole show. I really don't hope it's like all fillerish episodes. <laughs> Please don't 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 give me one of those anymore. The treasure that washed the shore. Nice! The outfit! Nice, nice, nice. Okay. 
Oh, not oh, not towel. Oh, oh, it's free cocoa. Sorry, I was thinking about a uh, not towel. Wow, that that voice is confusing. Mm. <laughs> mm. Oh, look out for the, on the observation deck. Interesting. Ah. No problem with the engine. So are they are they, are they gonna land? But she says no problem with the engine. Oh. Oh, they have anchors. Wow, just like a ship. Hmm. Other with the Pokemon as well. Nice, Al, like our creamy, palmy, slagma. Oh, leaking gas. No one has materials. Oh, an an old man that lo that look after me, huh? Oh, Freed had someone like you know f familiar in this island. Oh, ah, you scratched the wing, <laughs> and a fire Pokemon just landed into water. Great. And uh, yes, the Cragsley are with this old man. I want to know about this old man, man. Okay, Roy. Hmm. Hmm. Skipping stones, cool, cool, cool. Ah, the flag. I mean, I got, I gotta love the the, the symbol for for that flag because it's Pikachu with ball tackle. Uh Ah <laughs> she's bad at sewing. <laughs> mm. Ah No clues. I mean, yeah, she, yeah, is trying to sing. I mean, Frey Coco does have some, like, you know, song move, right? Nice. I looks up to it. Ah, fire type. Yeah, I guess. Both are starters. Fire type. A very powerful fire type for uh, Charizard. Ah, uh, there's a scratches. There are scratches. <laughs> Yeah, I guess you I guess you gotta fix that as well, huh? <laughs> More work. Hmm.
All right, he seems to be okay. He's heading towards the forest. And this is how they met. Uh, Frey Coco and Roy. Nice. Today's desk. Oh my gosh, the I yo, the Rotten phone can turn to Rotten Pad? That's that's some high tech. I never seen that in journeys. They just upgraded the, the whole device. Hmm. Now catch a Pikachu. Pokeball. Ah, a lot of Kanto Pokemon. <laughs> oh, Conquer Gym. Oh, Totem Pokemon. So she's in Alola. Okay. She's in Alola, and he's gonna go gym. The mysterious Pokeball. Okay. Ah. Maybe that's Roy's like secret hideout, I feel like. Mm. Oh no! Ah! Oh. Careful, careful, careful! Ah, uh, Gulumin. It's always Gulumin. I just want to. I just want to want to know if it's the old man or not in the, inside that costume. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh, Scyther. Those could be dangerous. Oh. Ah. Wormberry. Those are always good. Ah, Frey Coco. Uh, Free Coco singing again. Mm. Ooh, that's actually a good tree. Ah, uh, look at that rare Pokemon, Roy. Catch it, a rare Pokemon. <laughs> yeah, a Pokemon that you've never seen before. Of course, this is a Kanto region. She le leads him to the airship. Nice. Mm. Mm. 
balloon materials. Ah. Uh. I mean, he has the rotten form. Go check your Pokedex. <laughs> ah. I mean, I have to say, Roy is very like energetic. Wow, I mean Roy does really reminds me of uh, like of Ash. I you know I was just listening if Roy is actually singing like a Pokemon theme or not, but I guess it's not not that familiar. Careful, careful. Rico is having a lot of fun getting chased by a lot of Pokemon. <laughs> Go on adventures. There's a lot. There's a lot. Especially right now is Paldea. Nah. Uh, oh, the Pokeball is glowing! Oh, that mysterious Pokeball is glowing! Oh, the Pandit! Yo! The Pokeball and the Pandit are connected! Are, are linked! Somehow. Nice. Okay. Mm -mm. Ah. Mm. <laughs> uh, my treasure <laughs> ancient ancient pokeball nice oh it won't open and it's probably empty, huh? No, something is definitely inside, I feel like. It's glowing. Uh, ancient adventures. They face legendary Pokemon, travels the world. Uh, looking for Pokemon and treasure. Wow, that sounds like a mystery dungeon plot line. <laughs> oh, they're back. Wanna do a Pokemon battle? They're all grass type and bug type. You, you spray Coco. Ah. Oh. Ah, ah, they got caught. <laughs> That's funny. 
Uh, so Frey Coco is like, you know, he cannot use that for fire move that well. Wow. It's always the fire starters who has trouble. Charizard. Uh, yeah, 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 it's gonna, it's, it's overkill. Let's go. Oh, nice! Great dodging! Yo! Look at Freed and Cap! Nice! Those move, those movement. Alright. Oh, Lumberries! I guess those are tasty. Uh, something like that. I'm a Pokemon professor. Uh -huh. Oh. Ah. That's very, that's very nice. Thank you, thank you. Ah, uh, wait, they're gonna leave like that? Roy! It's kinda, yeah, Roy's like a little bit sad, right? He, he wants to go. So Free Coco is still singing. What what kind of move that will be? It's definitely not the like the signature move, right? Because you can only learn that when in the final state. Oh. Oh, let's not forget about the tracker. Oh, the Explorers has a tracker on it. The pendant has shined. Oh? Wait, Gibeo! Tremendous energy. Master Gibeo, who? So he has a boss. Uh, highly capable, huh? And they're in a submarine. Cool, cool, cool. Definitely better than Team Rocket submarine. <laughs> Very high, high events. Okay, to, to be continued. Interesting. Once again, the Poké Rap! Let's go! <laughs> and Roy, next episode you're gonna go, you're gonna join in. I feel like the explorers are gonna mess up, and Roy is somehow gonna get caught in it, and we figure out that he and Fre Fre Coco are best partners. So he's gonna go. He's gonna go. Let's go. Mm -mm. <laughs> can cannot wait to get to Paldea, man. Look at all those Paldea Pokemon. I want to see them in anime. <laughs> uh, and yeah, I want to see a uh, graveyard, which is uh, Bochi. I, I want to know. I want to see that. In... Mm. 
So right now, I guess you know the even the explorers had some boss that are actually being the mastermind. So his name is Gibeo. Interesting, just, you know, just like Team Team Rocket, right? They have Giovanni, and now we got this Gibeon guy, and he's the host learning of the the explorers team. Interesting. <laughs> They're only showing Paldea and Kanto Pokemon over there. That which is definitely unique. <laughs> nice. All right, seminar. Nice, nice, nice. Free Coco. Similar size as uh, Pokemon, as uh, uh, Pikachu. Hmm. I choose happiness. I choose A. Oh, all of them. You know, I'm not really that familiar with all the Paldea Pokemon, so forgive me. <laughs> when it's hungry. Wow, that's very obvious. Okay. Oh, oh Roy went, went into the airship. <laughs> they, yeah, she seems exhausted. Oh, the, the 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 grandpa's a little bit like angry. Roy, I found you free Coco. Ooh, due due, due to the preview, I don't think Roy's grandpa is like too happy for letting Roy go outside the island. I guess. In, like interesting we have to build the bond and actually convince his grandpa to, to actually let Roy join the team yeah very excited for next episode definitely uh, this is Pokemon Horizon episode 4 what a great episode so they end up into Roy's island the interaction was pretty good was pretty good we're really building up with the you know with the bond right so love it and now we're we get to see that like Roy is holding that mysterious Pokeball definitely something is inside just like the tropical look like uh like a uh, pokemon that we see in rico's pendant yes i know the the fact that we got news for the new pokemon it seems like they're saying that that is, that is not tropical but it's like a look like kind of pokemon so i, I was assuming that it could be like a pre-evolved form but right now it seems that like we still haven't got the names yet and they kind of clearly said said that that's definitely not tropical so I'm very curious on what kind of Pokemon that like uh, that is from now on, and yeah, because it it, it actually glow and is it, it and is like it's linked to Rico's pendant, which is definitely very surprising. So both of the incident are like are actually like combined, and also we get to hear Roy is saying that all of these like ancient adventures. That's also very interesting too interesting so they were like you know they were battling legendary pokemon uh catching uh, pokemon and try to find uh like treasure you know i said that it, it definitely gives me like a mystery dungeon kind of, uh, kind of plot but yeah it's just basically exploration and they were saying that yo like uh like those guys were able to challenge legendary pokemon so that's also very surprising and also yes we know that due to the preview and the trailers we get to see the shiny requaza right i want to see that as soon as possible it seems that the, the, the requaza is kind of like terrestrialized for a bit so i feel like we're gonna get to see that in when they reach paldea i'm very excited i wonder when are we gonna get to paldea because next episode, I feel like we're going to finish with like picking up Roy and they were heading to Paldea, maybe, you know, episode four, maybe episode seven or eight. Can we actually she get there or it's going to take like longer than that? I'm very curious. Oh, my God. These mystery man. I, yeah, the storytelling is getting it's getting there. It's getting there. Next episode, we're getting the explorers. They're trying to attack them again because they have. Rico and the pendant, right? And, you know, as soon as I feel like if they found out what Roy and had had that ancient uh, Pokeball, they're going to get Roy and uh, Rico at the same time. So that's also very surprising. And also, yes, I do know the leak that uh, like you know we get to see Rico and Roy are battling a Mithril. It's it that's also confirmed as well. That's it's it's like we're getting two 
versus one. So uh, that's kind of like Pokemon uh, battle. So I'm really excited for that as well. All right, let's just wait until what we can see in the next episode. Super excited for Pokemon Horizon, definitely. All right, thanks guys for watching the video. Please leave a like and comment, and also subscribe to the channel if you enjoy my live action. And I'll see you guys next time. Thank you very much.